Hi, I'm Laura Verrilli, and I inspire advisors to kill it online through social media. And that was way too fast. Yeah, like a ricochet rabbit. Ding, ding. Hi, I'm Laura Verrilli, and I inspire advisors to kill it online through social media and offline through relationship management. In today's episode, I'm going to discuss a best practice with you that advisors are using and gaining a lot of traction and assets because of it. It's called social listening. Are your listening ears on? There's a lot going on within your clients and prospects worlds, and a lot of it is online, being shared online, and you should be listening to it. How? Super duper easy. Where do you find this? Well, you find this under connections and then keep in touch. There's a black bar across the top on LinkedIn, connections, keep in touch. Go in there and it will be a consolidated view of three main things that are happening within your client's world. One, birthdays, two, work anniversaries, and three, new jobs. I'm going to go through the importance of each. I'm sure that you're calling your clients for their birthdays, sending them cards. This is yet another way to reach out and touch a client for a special occasion, their birthday. You might not necessarily know a prospect's birthday. This is a great way to drip on a prospect, stay in front of them, and show that you care. The second social trigger is a work anniversary. Some advisors think the work anniversaries are a little fluffy. You can use it at your discretion. However, advisors have reached out and have had some great success because of it. It's because you are showing that you care and that you're listening and that you know what's going on within clients and prospects worlds. With respect to a client, I absolutely would encourage you to reach out and wish them a happy work anniversary if it's a milestone anniversary, a five, a 10, a 15, a 20, so on and so forth anniversary. Better yet, pick up the phone, call them, take them out for a drink, whatever the case may be, and celebrate. Again, it shows that you care. The third one is a new job, and that is money in motion. You wanna make sure that you look at the client's profile or the prospect's profile to make sure that it is in fact a new job because LinkedIn will trigger a new job notification if someone has a title change, and that could even mean a title change in losing their job. So you wanna make sure that you look at their profile and, and they really truly do have a new job. Even if it is a title change, if they went from director to managing director, pick up the phone and congratulate them. However, um, some folks do leave one company and go to another. That is a new job and that is money in motion. So you absolutely want to pick up the phone, congratulate them, invite them out for drinks, dinner, coffee, whatever the case may be, and ask them, hey, do you need any help with those rollover assets? You might not necessarily know a prospect's information, so send them a personalized message. Again, provided you're connected to them on LinkedIn, you can go to their profile, hit the blue box that says send message, a dialogue box opens up, and then you can just personalize the message from there. To summarize, make sure that you have your social listening ears on, and there are three social triggers that are happening that you need to react to. You always wanna pick up the phone because that shows that you care, and call that client or prospect, if you don't have that capability or if you wanna send them a personalized message, don't write on someone's wall. The way to do that is to go to their profile. On their profile, there's a blue box that says send message. Click on that and you can send a message and personalize it. It shows that you care and that you're a sincere advisor. If you need a refresher on the information I covered today, there's a quick reference guide below. And for more great information on how to kill it online and off, tune into future episodes. Thanks for joining and don't forget to follow me and subscribe to me and do all that. Pick up the phone and congratulate them. Um, 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 I'm told I'm said um too much. Now, <laughs> now I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> How? Super duper easy. Super duper, super duper easy. <laughs>